Yo, welcome to Feeding Time. I am the big guy, Ryback, back, back again. I got my seatbelt on. I'm all discombobulated today, guys. It's been a been a busy day. Got a nice Dunkin' Donuts coffee here. All right, guys. I've seen. I, I'm a, I'm the I'm the people's food reviewer here. It, 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 it's 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 just common knowledge these days. And I see in the comments, I've seen people. Do the Taco Bell nacho cheese fries, big guy, please. We want your thoughts. We want to know what your big caveman Neanderthal stupid mind thinks about those nacho cheese fries. Guys, big guy's hungry today. I ain't wasting any time. This ain't a little bitch channel. You've heard me say that before, and it ain't. It's not. I'm gonna, I got my little food tray all hooked up right here. Just keep on fucking driving. I really get pissed when I see people slow down in front of me. Even though I got the dark tent windows, the front you can see in. Son of a bitch. Go to McDonald's, you fat fuck. Mm. My cheat meal, a continuation of my cheat meal from my earlier Beyond Meat Donut Sandwich review, which may or may not be out before this, I'm not sure. And then I go on a 24 hour fast. I needed a few more calories after my big ass workout. Mm. Holy hell. Is there nothing that's not good in nacho cheese? What about a donut nacho cheese sandwich? But I would need something on it where you just layer the cheese on the donuts. Mm. I should have got 20 of these. Mm. I'm so hungry, guys. I'm just let me eat. Just shut the fuck up and let me eat. Oh, you little fucking Jeffries out there bitching about me talking. Oh, you can just enjoy me eating, you fucking weirdos. Mm. I need all the calories and I need more information. Another cheese sauce. Oh shit, one of the fries fell in the bag. Can't have that. You gotta consume all the information. A little reset. A little Feed me more nutrition. BCAAs. Mm. It's feeding time, bitches. All right. Round two. Ah, oh, shit. Can't consume these fast enough. Mm. I put a tweet out earlier. I feel really strongly about this. It's true. that striving for excellence and financial freedom in our lives. And if we don't, 
what happens is we end up becoming a slave to the system that we all live in. And we can agree with it, not agree with it. It's what we live in. And I, and I, and I came across this a long time ago, and it's something that always sits in my mind. And it's like one of the most selfish things we could do as human beings is not try to be our best. Um, because like when, just as an example, you know, when you're older and your parents, you know, and, and, and grant, God forbid, their health starts to go, who's going to take care of them? If you can't even afford to take care of yourself, um, unfortunately, in the way the world's set up, it's not good. And you're kind of um, at the mercy of the system. So I put a tweet out and it's very positive, but... It's one of the things that motivates me to stay hungry is to strive for excellence to be in our best because if we don't, we're being really selfish. I, and I use, like Sophie, my dog, if I couldn't have afforded to, um, through my hard work and killing myself, and, and then the True Panion insurance helped a lot, but most people put their dogs down after their first back procedure, maybe second, they said tops. She had seven of them and she's doing better than ever now, Got you know, God bless her. But I was—I had that choice because I pushed myself. Just something to think about. While I enjoy these nacho cheese fries. Oh, we're gonna go for a big dip. The big dipper. Mmm. Mmm. I want more fries, I have more cheese. Fuck. I'm gonna eat the rest of this cheese because I'm a fucking loser. Mm. Nothing to see here. Now uh, this food tray, I gotta dump my food tray out. One second, guys. <clears throat> it's not COVID-19, that was a food cough. Just chill the fuck out, everyone. Chill the fuck out. I'm doing a little cleanup here, cleanup crew. So that if I got pulled over, I, I'm not completely ashamed of myself. Sir, you have bags of food and empty food all over the place and crumbs, you pig. Oh. All right, guys, review time. That was the, uh, the, the Taco Bell nacho cheese fries. I'm not like, the, I, I eat this stuff for my cheat meal. Now we go to the fast and I go back to my vegetarian diet. Which that was um, that the vegetarian that's not vegan that's vegetarian know the fucking difference, okay? I'm kidding because I didn't know the difference until I started it. Um, five stars out of one through five. Five stars. That was if you couldn't tell that I didn't. That was as I again. If you filled, if you gave me, if you gave me this scenario, just 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 hear me out. If you put two pools in front of me. And you got a pool of the nacho cheese and you got a pool of the Papa John's garlic butter sauce. And you say, big guy. And then you got you got the fucking fries here and I got the fries with me and I get to jump in with the fries. Or you got me the Papa John's pizza over there and I get to have fucking some pizza and fucking dive into the butter sauce. If you put me in that scenario, it's like the fuck, Mary kill deal. deal. Like, I, I don't fucking know what I'm doing. That's how good those were. Because if you know me, you know I love that Papa John's garlic butter sauce and pizza. But I love those, damn it. Those were absolutely del delicious. They just, the, the texture, everything. And the, 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 not, the nacho cheese is just... Can you imagine a fucking pool combined with nacho cheese and garlic butter sauce? Just the best of both worlds filled up together. Pizza, cheese fries, just fucking going in head first. I don't condone this stuff. This stuff is horrible for human beings. They use a lot of shitty ingredients. 
but at the end of the day, I'm doing an entertaining video so you guys get to fucking know me and uh, to not believe all the stupid other bullshit that's been put out by other fucking fake wrestling organizations and other bullshit. And that way you get to know me. And then, you know, my podcast, Conversation with the Big Guy Ryback, right and my supplement line, Feed Me More Nutrition, Sweeten the Stevia and Monk Fruit and Artificial Sweeteners and Colors, available on feedmemore.com. I love you guys. If you guys can leave a thumbs up, that's fucking cool. If uh, you want to you wanna leave a nice comment, I appreciate it. I see them. I, live, I leave the likes on those guys. I'm uh, we very active on social media from morning to night. It is uh, my business and my job. I'm, uh, I'm very, and I have, I have a team of people working with me now. And uh, we've just brought on a new person onto Pinterest. And we are growing on that platform as well. As well as me doing some work on there still. And uh, we are growing this bad boy more and more. Feed me more. Thank you guys for watching though. Have a great day, great week. And uh, get hungry, stay hungry. Feed me more. Thank you guys very much for watching Ryback TV. If you could smash that subscribe, hit that like button, share this channel, and for Feed Me More Nutrition on feedmemore.com, save 10% with Podcast 10, click here for my podcast conversation with the big guy Ryback, available on all podcast platforms. Click here. And for more videos of yours truly on Ryback TV, click here. Feed me more.